Hello friends, welcome back to Anjum's Kitchen and today we are going to make chicken pasta in white sauce. For that we will take capsicum, carrots, corn, one bowl of each, one tablespoon of sunflower oil, one bowl of penny pasta, one tablespoon of refined flour, one tablespoon of butter, salt to taste and I have got some marinated chicken that is around 100 grams of marinated chicken in lemon juice and spices I have listed the spices in the description box down below 1 teaspoon of uh, chopped garlic 1 teaspoon of chili flakes some oregano for taste to sprinkle and 1 teaspoon of fresh ground pepper 1 mug of full fat cream milk so let's start Let's begin making the pasta. Let's take 3 glasses of water and add to that 1 tablespoon of sunflower oil. Stir well and add 1 teaspoon of salt to taste. We will add in 1 bowl of pasta and let it boil on high heat for around 7 to 10 minutes. Let's come back to it after 7 to 10 minutes to check whether it's cooked we can check this by cutting it into half with a knife if it cuts properly and smoothly it's cooked if it's a little difficult like this we'll cook it again for another three to four minutes so I'll leave it in for three to four minutes and look after three to four minutes it's done well so I'm going to strain out the excess water and put it into a bowl Let's take 1 tablespoon of sunflower oil, add 1 teaspoon of the chopped garlic to this and we will saute this lightly on medium flame or even we can saute this on slow flame and then after a couple of minutes add in the carrots that is 1 cup of carrot nice and chopped to bit size pieces. Then the chicken, this is around 150 grams to 100 grams of chicken marinated with a little bit of salt, lemon juice and spices. I've added a little bit of oil and I'm going to sort this for around 1 to 2 minutes. Then add in the corn, that's about 1 cup of corn and 1 cup of capsicum nicely chopped. We'll saute this well for around 3 to 4 minutes till they're nicely cooked. See it looks nice and colourful. I'm going to take this out on a plate now and keep it aside. Next we're going to take 1 tablespoon of butter. Let the butter melt a bit. To this I'm going to add 1 tablespoon of refined flour. Saute this flour on medium flame for around 1 to 2 minutes till it changes color. Mix it well with the butter. Do not keep it on high flame, we don't want to burn this. To this we'll add one mug full of full fat cream milk. The more the cream, the better it is. If you want a nice rich creamy texture pasta. I'm going to nicely dissolve all the lumps into this till we get a nice consistency like this. See the sauce is done. Let it cook for around 3 to 4 minutes on slow flame. Then add in 1 teaspoon of the chili flakes. 1 teaspoon of freshly ground pepper and nicely stir this. 
just a sprinkle of oregano we can also sprinkle oregano once we finish with the pasta just before serving see the consistency should be like this nice and creamy to this I'm adding just a pinch of salt and then give it a slight stir add in the vegetables after adding the vegetables we'll just give it a stir to blend the vegetables in nicely with the sauce if you feel the sauce is too thick you can add a little bit of milk to adjust the consistency to a nice smooth pouring consistency like this look it's a nice consistency once we've reached this consistency add in the pasta Add the pasta slowly, you don't want to mash the pasta up and blend in the pasta nicely slowly into the white sauce. Once it's nicely blended, you can cover this up for around 30 seconds to a minute and then serve this piping hot. Dish it nicely onto a plate. While serving, see that you ensure that you don't break the pasta while serving. Look, it looks amazing, delicious and it's ready to be served. And the chicken and the sauces and the succulentness of this pasta is absolutely awesome. You should try this recipe at home and do let me know how you like it. I've just sprinkled a little bit of oregano and I'm going to just take a bite of the pasta. Let me see how it tastes. Okay, I'll just try this now. Mm, it's amazing amazing the taste is absolutely fabulous you can try this at home and do share how you like the pasta for more such recipes stay tuned to my channel thanks for watching keep watching do like share and subscribe stay tuned bye for now